Hi, I'm Jim Miller, Corporate Chef for Crest Corps. We're here at the Crest Corps William R. Baggett Hospitality and Conference Center. Um, we're going to take a look at cooking with our quick therm ovens today, and we'll also get into some roast and hull ovens and hopefully smoking different things down the road. But this is the first in a series of videos that we're going to do for you. Never hesitate to call if you have any questions. Okay, during this segment, we're going to show you how to cook using the food probe. Um, it's a great option on the quick therm oven. So, number one, make sure that the probe itself is plugged into the unit. So that'll read and pick that up right in the control itself. Push the cook button. Set the temperature. We're going to take it all the way to 350 because we're going to cook some uh, chicken tenders for you. Push to set. Holding temperature on those. Uh, we'll go to 150. Push to set. And now it's asking for the probe temperature. So what internal temperature do you want the oven to stop cooking and to go into the whole cycle? So we always want to go down to uh, temperature below the finished temperature. I'm going to go to 155 internal and uh, it'll carry over that extra 10 degrees and take it to 165. Okay? So once it's up to temperature, we'll be able to load the food, insert the probe into the, the food product and take it from there. Okay, now that the oven is up to temperature, let's load our chicken. Using a sterile wipe, we're going to clean the probe, make sure it's properly cleaned and ready to go. Pick a nice plump piece of chicken and insert the probe into the middle. Close the door, push start, and it's showing you the internal temperature of the food itself. So the chicken, um, which is coming out of the freezer, is actually at 48 degrees and that'll display until it gets to the 155 degrees and then it'll go into a cook the holding cycle from there. So we've probed the chicken, it's gone through its cooking process, it has now have gone into hold, it's showing you that the hold temp is at 150. Um, for two minutes now it's been on hold. But what's important I wanted to show you, there's a display button right here. If you push that display, it says we set the temperature on hold at 150 two minutes time, uh, the 350 was cooked, but now that chicken breast is up to 170. If you recall, we set it for 155 on the probe internal. As I told you, there's carryover cooking when the oven goes into hold. So never set it above or right at 165. Always go below 150 to 155 and allow the food to carry over that says 171P, so the chicken breast is already at 171. So it's already temped for you. So let's take it out of the oven. I'll have to remove the probe. And you have some beautiful chicken breast as a result. If you see the low water switch illuminated, it's like, oops, I need to add a little bit of water to the control. That's all that means. It's not going to hurt anything. So just simply get another pitcher of water and you can add it to the water tank down below. Here we have the humidity water tank for the quick therm oven. Simply remove the cover. You'll see the heating element down below that will heat the water. And there's also two float valves. Just fill it with four gallons of water. Replace the top. and you're ready to go. In uh, draining to clean out the water tank in the bottom of the unit, you can slide the oven over a floor drain in the kitchen as um, long as one is available. If not, you can also take a uh, 12 by 20 pan, slide it beneath the unit itself, and then do the same process. Just pull that green handle toward the front, That'll open the front drain valve 
and you can get the water out of the unit for cleaning and sanitizing. The tool, um, we do have a guideline for you that's set up for retherming most of the normal foods that are used in every school food service operation. So you can find these online at our website at crestcore.com or simply reach out to us, send us a note, and we'd be more than happy to send you some laminated ones to put on your ovens till your people get acclimated to the oven itself. Okay, well, we just wanted to thank you for uh, taking the time to learn a bit more about the uh, Quick Therm Oven from Crestcore. And uh, we will continue to do different food items and different things to uh, help you along. If you see something that you're curious about, please get in touch with us. Um, you can reach us um, on the 800 number or at the website at crestscore.com. And uh, we thank you for your patronage and all your support. Have a great day.